Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, towards the end of last year, I let you know that Microsoft had released an update for the Microsoft Copilot app for Windows 11 that replaces the previous Copilot progressive web app with a so-called native version. And I'll leave that video linked down below and in the end screen if you'd like more info. Now, something else that the new update introduced for Copilot is that you can now also access a new quick view for Copilot using the Alt and Space keyboard shortcut on your keyboard, as you can see. And in regards to the Alt and Space keyboard shortcut, I had noticed today that there was a new update for the Copilot app through the Microsoft Store. And when I launched the app for the first time, I did notice this little pop-up. Shortcut to Copilot, use Alt and Space to talk to Copilot anytime on your PC. Now, it has always been possible to launch the new Copilot app by pressing Alt and Space um, shortcut. I did notice that when the new so-called native version rolled out. But it seems now that when you first launch the app after updating it from the Microsoft Store, that Microsoft now is trying to get the message across that Alt and Space can be used now um, to open the app and talk to Copilot anytime on your PC. And if you want to disable the uh, the Alt and Space shortcut, maybe you're using it for something else, um, it's assigned to something else as a shortcut on your PC, then it's actually quite simple to do. And what you would do is you would head into the Copilot app, just head up to your settings, and there we go. And you can see Enable Alt and Space shortcut. Now the interesting thing is that that pop-up showed even with the setting enabled like it currently is. So um, I don't know why Microsoft does it. I would think they would only show the pop-up if you had this disabled. So you can disable that Alt and Space by just clicking on the relevant option. And as mentioned, you would think that Windows key and C would then launch Copilot. This is obviously if you haven't got a, a co dedicated Copilot key on your uh, keyboard, which I don't. And Windows and C used to um, launch Cortana, as you may know, but Win and C doesn't work. Only Alt and Space does. So if you want to obviously enable that option, as you can see from the pop-up, you can turn on, not now. And if we head back into the app, just enable that there we go, and Alt and Space, and there we go, it enables the quick view. So just letting you guys know that that's the latest in case you were unaware. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.